Good morning, everybody. Today, I want to tell you about a very special project that happened about a year ago. Um, this came about from a special request by um, R.H. Uh, World's, largest, lux World's largest luxury retailer. And they wanted a board for their yacht owners and for their own yacht. And uh, we made a series of these boards. Uh, we were not allowed to disclose it, but this is the next generation where we took the same board that you see uh, and added the 12K carbon to it. Um, this is a very, very limited, we didn't make two of them. Uh, one in this size and one in 11.6. Um, as you can see, you know, it's again all naked. Um, so it's not 100% flawless. It's impossible to make a 100% flawless uh, carbon board because if it is flawless, it's probably fake because you can buy carbon texture and just use it as decal. Like they use vinyl wraps on boats, on cars. You know, they are perfect because um, it's a wrap. Hey, Goaty. Yeah. Hey, Goaty. We have a guest today, our pet goat. Anyway, um, so... When you do actual real-world lamination, um, there will be little folds here and there. It moves a little bit, including the 12K carbon. But this does reflect heat. We haven't perfected uh, the ability to do the whole board because this fabric is so stiff. It can bend. can bend around corners like this. can bend in a wet wheel well like this. It needs a finer knit to do that. So we only lay this on flat surfaces, which is what... This material is for is for flat surfaces. So next year we will really try to do something special in production. But this is the board. It's a touring board. It's 12 six by seven by uh, 32, and it's got about 288 liters. It will float anything. Um, it's fast, as you can tell from the nose. Yeah, and uh, and it also has a double concave bottom, as you can see. Very light. A very light board for being how big it is. See? Look. Come around. It is another one of those impossible boards that our production team hates to do because look at the acres of carbon fiber to finish properly. It takes forever. I could probably make 10 boards, normal carbon painted boards, which we don't, in doing one of these. It's this, uh, you know, it takes forever to finish a board like this. Yep, come around. So. Once in a while, we do something really special like this. Look how light it is. It's amazing. We will do this by special orders. It will take some time, probably at least eight to nine months to get it done because we have to go through a long line of other production stuff. And uh, if you do want something special like this, it can be done. But talk to me individually. Thank you. And also, guys, I also want to tell you about this 12K in case you haven't seen it from our other, our other videos. Why do we call this 12K? Come closer. Watch this. Right down to here. That means there's 12,000 fibers going this way, 12,000 fibers going this These guys linked up this way, right? So it's very strong, right? Um, this is 3K. 3,000 fibers by 3,000. It's a weave. So that's the difference, you know? Uh, these kind of fibers are not meant to be bent around a corner, but it is super strong. It basically has a metallic feel to it, and um, it's hard to get also, you know. Obviously, we have paddles made like that, but it's made in a mold. This is just vacuumed back multiple times. As you can see, um, we can't really... Uh, I mean, it, it, the goal was to make an entire board in silver. That's my next step, you know, it's called what I call the Silver Surfer Project. 
it's like a Marvel Comics superhero board. But we are not there yet. But I'm going to keep plugging away at it. And one day we'll get there. Stop. So, thank you. Now I can take the video of the full board walk away. Now the sun's up. Wow. Fucking.